You know, I believe our state of mind and the actions we take right now is how we're going to be remembered through this time. So ask yourself a question. How do you want to be remembered through this crazy time? By your family, by your friends, by your loved ones, by your close associates, by your pastor, by your employees, by your employer, anybody that's in your circle, how do you want to be remembered? Do you want to be seen as someone who's a leader through this and that helps the people get out of their own way? Or do you want to be someone who's thought of as a fearful person that shoved their head in the sand and said, I'm not coming out. I'm not going to leave my house. I'm not going to talk to anybody. I'm not going to encourage anybody. And I'm scared to death. Because right now you have a chance to be a leader in your own world. How you think about this situation is how you're going to act. So decide right now if you want to be a leader or a follower or do nothing. Well, I promise you, if you're not a leader, you're a follower of somebody. So be a strong leader through this time. We need strong leaders to step up and show up and be there to help other people get through this time. And I think you'll see that when this passes, people look back at this time and say, wow, you were strong through that. We did make it through. It did pass, like a lot of people said, and you were right there and you, you were a rock in the time of a storm. So I encourage you to be a rock in the time of this storm and not be someone that just hides away. Be a rock and be a leader, because right now, we need it more than ever.